the newest Tesla software update just got downloaded to my Hardware 4 Model Y. We just made a video about the Hardware 3 holiday update. Let's go over the changes in the new Hardware 4 Teslas. So one of the Tesla features that is not in the older Intel Atom processor Teslas is this, the photo booth. Let's check it out. Hello, I didn't know that Tesla's interior cameras looked at this, so check this out. Your interior camera is watching you when you're using things like full self-driving to watch for drowsiness, driver attentiveness, and with this new software update, you can do fun things in this Tesla photo booth. So pretty interesting, even a Cybertruck homage. So hit the brake and you can exit here. Now, let me show you something else. There's a lot of other cool uh, updates in this uh, useful update. So Grok is one of them. If I go to my Grok, so you must have an AMD processor. So this is my wife's car and you can see it has a Grok integration. So that's pretty cool. Now, I've not seen this message, message before. Share precise location, get more accurate results for Grok when enabling a precise location. Without this, Grok can only determine your approximate location. Okay, interesting. That might be for the new feature, which is integration to this, the navigation. So now I can use Grok to edit and add destinations on my AMD processor Tesla. I also have new HOV lane preferences. Let's see here, my lock feature, what's new here? Oh, here it is, phone left behind, that's awesome. So let's see, if compatible device is left on the wireless charger, which is down here, your vehicle will chime a few seconds after your occupants exit and the doors close. So that's pretty cool. So you must have a UWB phone. So 27% of smartphones have a UWB feature. And if you leave it on the charger and you walk away from your Tesla with this new update, you're going to get that chime. So you also get a supercharger map overlay. Uh, so if I go into charging here, let's see where it says that. Okay, uh, okay, this is cool. Actually, this is not the supercharger overlay, but I can manually disable these wireless charge pads. Honestly, I don't really know why you would wanna do that. Maybe to not overheat your phone or what have you, but uh, that's a new function as well. So a lot of new functions, some of which are not in the older Intel Atom processors, but this one being a new Tesla has uh, some that I just showed you and a lot more. Put your questions down below. Now you know.